Hi, this is Paul at Reliable POD, and this is a video on how to create manual orders using the Reliable POD app. Uh, first thing you do, you log into your account, and when you come into your account, if you click on My Products here on the left hand side, and up at the top right, you can see New Manual Order. If you click on New Manual Order, you get this screen come up. And with two or three different types of products you can add to uh, a manual order. You can add existing products that you've already created, which are static products. So if you come here, click on Add Product, it will show you all the products you've got that are basically static. That, and a static product is something that doesn't have any personalization. You simply click on it and then select the variant you want if there's multiple variants you can show the advanced quantity selection so if you wanted three of those you can add it and that will add three and it'll pull the cost price uh, out of the software the next thing you can do is you can add a personalized product so let's say you've received an order on a platform uh, and somebody wants the text line adding on there. If you come into here, click add product, click on my personalized products. So the difference between these is the standard products, which are fixed with no personalization and the personalized products are ones that allow you to add text and upload photos. We'll just click on a simple one here which is the tin of chocolates. And then you can click on the button here, personalize your product. And you can add your text in there. You can alter the size, you can change the color. However, you've set up these uh, fields when you create the product, you can uh, change them. If you then click update product, and that will add that to the cart. It doesn't show you the personalization here. What you'll see is the fixed image. We are going to add that, but at the moment uh, it doesn't show that. Uh, but you can see there you've got an image code, so it has picked up your personalization. And then the next thing is if it's a completely new product that you want to add, you can come to here, click new product. Let's say we're going to add some jewelry uh i don't know eternal heart necklace and then you can basically add your design and basically add that product so it will come through here so once you've done that the next thing you want to do is click continue to shipping you can then add your address details in here of where it's going to uh, so let's see if I've got one here test address there yeah, I have uh, one, two, four, order down. oops not that wrong uh, that's in Florida uh, just remember when you're selecting here we only ship to the United States at the moment so you have to select United States. And then over here, you've got the email address and phone number. These are for the recipient. So this is for your customer. So if you put an address in here, when this ships, the customer will get an email notifying them it's shipped. Uh, that'll be a blind email. They won't know it's from us. You don't have to worry about that. But most people leave these blank, uh, basically because you've got your own system and notifying the customer. Uh, and that's it you then just go continue to review uh, once you've put uh, all the details in that you need and uh, oh you have to put a name in there as well sorry about that uh, it won't let you go past until you fill those in continue to review you can see the prices you can see the shipping if you haven't already set up a payment method uh, click on here and add your card details and uh, that's it. Just click purchase. Thank you very much. Cheers. Bye-bye.